。每次走过熟悉的街道，你和昨天还在这里停靠。那么多扇温暖的窗口，哪一个能收留我的微笑？曾经多少泛黄的美好，任由季节的风去平调，已经戒了往事的味道，我的心不会没。Passengers taking train D35 to Guangzhou West Station, please check in at waiting room number five. Passengers taking train D35 to Guangzhou West Station, please check in. Ma'am,、um, please don't go like this. You've only been back a few days ago. Please don't go. What are you doing? What are you doing? Go find one of your、It's、other girls. Business. I have to do what my customers ask me to do. What kind of business asks for that? Don't touch me with your dirty hands, Mr. Guan. Don't let her go. Train number seven five seven two from Dongan East Station to Nanchang Station is arriving soon. You have so much Please luggage. Please take all your belongings to train.、Oh, no, no, that's all right.、Come、It's on, okay.、Shana. We're taking the same train. Come on. I don't、train、have any luggage. Seven five seven two Come on. Thank you, then. East He's quite heavy. It's all right. Don't worry. Dear passengers, thank you for taking the train T957. We will be arriving at Dongwan Station shortly. Please take all your belongings and prepare to get off. Thank you. Do you have your ticket? It's in my pocket. I'll get it later. Xuan Xuan, get down now. You're tiring her. It's okay. I'm carrying my grandson all the time. He's even bigger. Be a good boy. Listen to her. Xuan Xuan's a good boy.
already what are you doing why didn't you get yourself kidnapped tell me tell me what you're good for I treat you like a queen I work so you don't have to for what for you to stay home and be a good mother and a good wife and what do you do huh you went wild and lost my son all you do is fly away not coming home now you blame me for everything Hey, away! I'm away doing my job, working hard! For you! For our family! For our son! I need to shop whenever you like! <laughs> this message, please go to the waiting hall. Your friends are waiting for you. Sir, how can I help you? Hi. Can you help me? I can't find my wife. She's in the airport. Can you make an announcement that I'm looking for? Sure, of course I can. Could you please register and write your wife's name here? I'm afraid it's too late. Her flight could take off any minute. Could you please make the announcement now? I'm sorry, but there are requests waiting. Miss Li Shufen, Miss Li Shufen, please come to the waiting hall. Your family. Sir! Sir Li Ju, it's Gong Jian. I'm at the broadcasting desk in the airport. Come here as soon as soon as you hear this. Sir Li Jun, it's Gong Jian. Sir Li Jun, it's Gong Jian. Where are you? Let go of you. Please stop you? telling me. Hey, Sir Li Jun, it's Gong Jian. Come find Come me. All right, just go. If you and a veteran, I'd arrest you. Just go. Go. No, I can't go yet. Where's the broadcasting room for the other terminals? I need to find my wife. I haven't found her hey, yet. Hey, sir, what are you doing? Sir, hey. can't behave hey. like this. Gong Jian! Sorry. I'm the person he's looking for. Keep your husband under control. He's a disturbing stuff. Don't do this again. What's this all about, Zhou Lijun? What do you want, huh? Why are you going to a foreign country? I told you already, we're divorcing. The baby. What did you do? She's gone. You had an abortion? It's not the right time for a baby. How could you be so cruel? It wasn't easy for me. Do you think I felt nothing? 
If I had any hope in our marriage, I wouldn't have done this. I rushed back home, thinking all about you and our baby. Now you've thrown it all away! It's too late. <sighs> anyway, it's gone. All my hope is gone, too. We've been married for ten years. If we're not in love, we're a family at least. How did you do this? How could you abort our child without telling me, huh? Are you my husband? You spend all your time with military things. When I need you, you're training or working out. Did you ever think about the kind of life I live? <sighs> anyway, I'm done talking. Please don't leave me. I've been transferred. I'm back now. All of the procedures are complete. I've come back so we can try again. I'll be with you every day. We'll have a new life. I'll support our family. Just give me another chance. You want a new start. Do you know how I feel? I've had enough of all of this. Then just go to hell. <laughs> Get divorced. You're dead. Hey, are you the courier? Hi, that's right, Shuntong Express. Thanks. Are you... Lian? Yes. Please sign right here. Is it okay? All right, here you go. Thanks. Sorry, please wait a second. 
Have a look at this. If anyone sees him, call my number. You are... That's my son. He was abducted five years ago at Beijing train station. He's my only family. I've been looking for him every day for the past five years. If you hear or see anything, please call me right away. Sure. Thank you. No problem. Gong Zhang's playing hard, huh? He got us all beat. Pretty tough, right? He can't beat us every time. Next time. Gong Jian will beat you next time. It's killing me. Hello? What's up? Yeah, I thought it was all settled. Why are you calling? Fine. I can be there in 20 minutes. Every day, we're behind in our goals. This is zero hour. The boss is still playing. He's not a very good leader. That's what you think? He only has one pastime? If he's indulging himself, how could he get an MBA degree in one year? If he's indulging so much, how could he have helped develop Bayer Real Estate from an unknown company into a large established one? Besides, this hobby is a way for him to deal with his emotions. He needs it to cope with what he went through, you know? What do you mean? You don't know him very well, do you? A few years ago, he was hit by a car. He survived it. But it was extremely traumatic. Fetishism. Take this. Sir. Hmm? What happened? Our reserve price was leaked. I was informed 30 minutes ago. I called you right away. Mr. Liu is with the finance department. The director is calculating the highest bid. Has the auction started? Yes. How's it going? Citu Estate beat our highest bid at the auction, 680 million. How is it now? 710. C2 calls it. Tongyo Estate. Tongyo? That guy Guan Hao? Site CT65 is one of our most high profile projects in the city. Is there any high bid? Okay. Number seven offers another 10 million. Now at 720 million. 720 million. Any high bid? Number 21. Number 21 offers 730 million. At 730 million. At 730 million. Number 7 offers 740 million. At 740 million. I just told our highest bid. We can go as high as 760 million. At 740 million. Any higher bid, everyone? 760 million. Number 21 bid 760 million. At 760 million. At 760 million. 800 million. Any higher bid? Make it 800 million. Yes, boss. 800 million. Number 10. Bay Al Group offers 800 million. Any higher bid? If anybody bids 810 million, we bid for 850. I'll go wash up. The sale goes to Bay Al Group for the number three site at the prime location. Congratulations. You have something on your ear. Hello? Can you see me? You were trying hard. 800 million. You're tough than I thought. Well, I sure am. The site's too important to let go. You've got more funds than I thought. You're becoming quite the big shot investor. And yet whatever I have is still not enough to outbid you. <laughs> Are you going to that party? Of course I'm going. I have to vent my anger somewhere. Taste my revenge.
Susan, would you like for dinner? How about some dumplings? Susan, Susan. After dinner, Xuan Xuan, Xuan Xuan, Xuan Xuan. Mommy, what the hell are you doing? Stay away, crazy woman. Fifteen minutes ago, you told me you picked up the package. Now, fifteen minutes later, you're telling me the package is gone? I'm so sorry. I asked everyone. I'm thinking maybe it was stolen or thrown out by a cleaner. No excuses, please. Do you know what was inside? Important data files concerning my client. We need them in the meeting. You think one is sorry enough? A delivery woman losing her package? It's no different than a mother losing her own child. Is this how you serve your clients? I'll make sure that you're fired. Please don't worry. I'll go to your client's company to get the files. Don't you think? It's too late. The meeting is about to start. It's too late. Deng Sao Sao. Hey, it's Zhou Li Wen. Hi, Li Wen. I'm asking you to cut her some slack. She's my best friend. She made a simple mistake. This is my business. Could you please stay out of it? Forget it, Liwa. It really is my fault. Even if it is your fault, I'm going to take care of it. Besides, this is not just her company. Sun Nan Wei. Coming. I'm coming. Right. All right. All right. Sure. Okay. Thank you. Ah. Ah. Shang Xiang. It's uh. It's all sorted now. Our client will fax us the photocopies right away. The meeting will go as planned. Well done. Of course. Hey, Mr. Nanwei. Well done. Whenever you see Li Wen, you go blind. Where's your authority? Ah, right. You have a meeting. It's time, right? Oh. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. See you, Miss Shang Shang. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Li Wen. Sorry for all the troubles that I caused you.、Uh, Don't apologize to him.、Uh, <laughs> It's fine. Let、uh, me introduce. This is Dong Sao Sao,、uh, my college mate and best friend. This is Sun Nan Wei, my ex-husband.、Uh, but we're friends now. <laughs> Good friends. <laughs> <laughs> friends. Okay.、Uh, you two have a chat. I have something I have to do. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Dear, I've been looking for you for ages. I haven't heard from you for years. I thought you married Guan Hao. Thought you'd be rich by now. Why? Why are you delivering packages? Where is he? We divorced. What happened? It's strange, really. 
The company built this for our executives. Mr. Young kept it for years for you, but you wouldn't move in. Could I live in a house this big? Yeah, it's two apartments combined. What about this furniture? I arranged them. It's like a military museum. <laughs> Catering to your taste. Why is that? So you would like it. How did you find all these things? Whatever things you like, I can find them. Do you know what I like the most? <laughs> I like seeing you react like this. No need. Don't be modest. If you need it, you work as a delivery woman. How much can you earn? I do this job just to find my son. Ah! What's going on? <laughs> it's all right. It happens a lot. I'll put in a new one. What are you picking up? Here. Give me a hand. Hold this. Oh, flash the light this way. You even have a flashlight? Shine it where? A bit higher. Is it okay? You're so resourceful. Sun Wei takes care of all this stuff in my house. You don't need a man to help you. You're resourceful. Ugh. When you don't have a man to help, you have to do it all yourself. Honey, it's so cold in here. I can't stand it. How about we go someplace warm? To where? To a bar nearby. A bar? Go get changed. Let's get a drink. Wait for me then. Going to a bar with a ring? What are you trying to avoid? Trying to avoid trouble. I came here to get drunk, go home, have a nice sleep, nothing else. Listen to me. I can tell looking at you, you've been alone for too long. A woman can't stay alone for so long without getting sick. <sighs> I'm in good health. Delivering packages is good exercise. You need to look for your son, but you also need to find yourself a man. If you find your son, how will you manage to support him? Will he be able to have a happy and carefree childhood? As long as my son comes back, everything will be okay. I've been doing some research. I found you a job where you can look for your son and work at the same time. What kind of job? Sunanwe's firm. I'll put in a good word for you. I can't do it. His firm works with the police, you know. They can help with looking for your son. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. I'm not finished yet. There is a condition. What is it? A blind date. <sighs> no date, no job. You're forcing me. I'm not. But you should go on a date anyway. Here's the thing. My uncle asked me to introduce a girlfriend to my ex-brother-in-law. It has been a long time since he met anyone. Do it as a favor to me. Go meet him, okay? Your ex-brother-in-law? Right. 
He's my uncle's former employee. He's a transferred serviceman, divorced from my sister for about five years. He's very nice. No more talking. It's a yes. Ugh. I have to take this. Oh, I need to pick up my little prince. Bill, please. Hmm, so now you want a lift? It's all right, I'm fine. Pick up your boy, don't let him wait. Okay. You had a lot to drink, are you driving? I'm fine. I'll take a taxi. See ya. Remember what you promised. Ugh. You promised me. See you. Here we go. Let's sit here. Okay. What would you like? Beer. Waiter. Yeah? Two beers, please. One minute. Just one beer. One cup of Blue Mountain coffee. Why do you like Blue Mountain coffee so much? It's just a habit, that's all. My ex-wife liked that kind of coffee. But we're in a bar. You may choose something else. Drink me, okay? Okay. Hmm. Waiter! Two yes? beers! Thanks. Just a minute. What do you like? Another bottle. Guess what? My work fills my life. No, thank you. No, thanks. Hey. The wine's open. Why not drink it? It's my treat. Please enjoy, sir. Mm. Hey, sexy. Are you alone? You're married? Is your husband happy you're here? I'd better sit over here. Really can't stand that crap. Let's swap then. I okay. can Hey, you're really pretty. Why would your husband leave you here? Mm. Let's go to mine. Smells so nice. <sighs> what perfume are you wearing? I use soap, Mr. Kong. You know, this is what bars are like. Is that normal? Fairly. Hey, sexy. Where are you going? Let's go to mine. I'll take care of you. I'm not interested. Keep away from me. Bad girls are my favorite. Sexy. Hey, don't go. S sexy, hey, don't go. <gasps> What are you doing? Don't pretend you don't want me. Piss off! Yo, who? Playing hard to get? Huh? I like it. Come to mine. What the hell? Who did that? Damn! You. Like I said, this is what bars are like. I know it's a bar. Still, this is unacceptable. Mr. Gong, it's getting late. Let's go back. Mom, come in. Oh, okay. Take off shoes? No, it's okay. 
Oh, have a look around. If you like it, move in and live with me, okay? Move in with you? I have my own house to take care of. Are you still working as a nanny? Cut it out. You know I'm not a nanny. I'm a housekeeper. Oh, this is so big. And nice? Very. Oh, this house is big, all right. But even still, it's so empty. Don't you agree with me? More than anything, you need a wife with you here. Mr. Gong, you're back. <laughs> Maybe you have someone in mind? <laughs> How did you get in? Uh, you know I have the spare key. Spare keys are for emergencies. No, who is this girl? Hello, ma'am. Ah, this is my assistant, Xiao Ri. Oh, I'm... Uh, I'm his mother. Uh, come with me, ma'am. Have some tea. Mr. Gong mentions you all the time. You don't know how much he misses you. You should move in with him. <laughs> don't fall for that. He doesn't want me here. He's afraid of my don't nagging. Worry. If you want to come over, just give me a call. I'll pick you up. Sometimes you need some girl talk, so talk to me. Uh, you two can have a chat. I can... It's all right. I'm leaving. Come on. Stay for a while. I have some things to do. I'll come by another day. Uh... Right, this is my card. If you need anything, just call me. Stay in touch. All right. Uh, <laughs> feel free to stop by. I will. Thank you. See you later, ma'am. Uh... Goodbye, Mr. Gong. Bye-bye. What a nice girl. Why didn't you introduce me to her earlier? Um, calm down, all right? I'm introducing you now. She's my assistant. What's wrong with being an assistant? You know her so well. Why not date her? Then later, she could be my daughter-in-law. Mom, I'm not really in the mood. Can you please drop it? Can you? How are you not worried? You're in your 30s, so you can't consider it? We need to talk. Sit down. Sit down! <sighs> oh, somebody's calling. Hello? Yes, sir. But it's the weekend. Okay. Mom, can we talk some other day? I need to go now. Can you stay here? What for? My old boss asked me to go to his office. He wants to talk. Old boss? Dad. I'm not your dad anymore. Don't call me dad. Call me sir. Sir. You should have told me you're not feeling well. I asked them not to tell anyone about my health conditions. Didn't want to bother people. Listen, I really saw God when I was feeling sick. But he said I couldn't die yet. He said, you haven't completed your work. Once I've finished it, then I'm allowed to go. <laughs> what is it? Yeah, I was thinking about that too. Why well, haven't I finished? I thought over and over for, for two days. Then it hit me. Know what it is? It's your marriage. <laughs> Dad, uh, hmm. sir, I, I can't get married right now. You said that two years ago. Now two years have passed. You're saying the same thing. You'll be turning 40 soon. You don't want to get married. But your mom's waiting for a grandson. We're sorry Li Jun left you. But me and your father can't let you stay single forever. Mom, don't say that. It doesn't work that way. Everything has been destined. That's in the past. Listen, your cousin Li Wen has a college friend. I've seen her picture. Hey, she's pretty. Her personally suits you. She's 30-ish. 
think about it, you should meet. Uh, no. Where, where? It's just a meeting. Okay. It's just a chat, right? Have dinner, okay? If it's fun, see her again. If not, that's fine too. I'm not asking you to marry her the first day you meet. Don't laugh. Hey, this is a mission. A mission? Uh-huh. Sure. It's a deal. Ha. <sighs> hey, pay the bill. Don't let the girl look yes. down upon you. you I'll me? complete my mission. At 3 p.m. at the cafe, you'll see a man with a copy of Harper's Bazaar. That will be my brother-in-law, ex-brother-in-law. I have saved his number on your phone. Are you all right? Chang Dan Fong. 